Welcome to my SU News Channel. Boyfriend of slain Idaho student Madison Mobin breaks silence on bloody attack. The grieving boyfriend of Madison Mobin, one of four murdered University of Idaho students, broke his weeks-long silence about the monstrous killings during a heartbreaking memorial in the town where one victim grew up. None of these people deserve this, Jake Schreiger said at the Friday vigil in Post Falls, hometown of slain student Zana Kernadal, 20. Schreiger, who knew all four victims, recounted his first date with Mogan, 21, at the Breakfast Club in Moscow, and how that friendship blossomed into romance. She was the first person I talked to every morning and the last person I talked to before bed, Schreiger said at the vigil at the Real Life Ministries. She was the person that I loved most. Mobin's close friend Kaylee Goncalves, 21, and Kernadal's boyfriend Ethan Chapin, 20, were also killed in the off-campus home in Moscow on November. 13. Schreiger's mom had told the post Mobin and Jake went together like peanut butter and jelly. Nearly three weeks after their bodies were found, authorities have not yet named a suspect or found the large knife believed to have been used in the massacre. Kaylee's parents, Steve and Christy Goncalves, and their other four children, Mogan's father, Ben Mogan, and Kernadal's dad, Jeffrey Kernadal, also attended the vigil. On Sunday, Steve Goncalves told the Post he's working with his own private investigators because he fears local authorities are too inexperienced. The distraught dad sharply criticized Moscow police, who backtracked on claims the killer appeared to be targeting at least one of the four victims and have yet to suggest a profile of the likely killer. Kaylee and Maddie were brutally stabbed to death along with Kernadal and Chapin, who were in a bed on the second floor. Source, nypost.com Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.